In this lab, we are going to examine how to publish a web server which is in the uh, DMZ to the external client. So let's open our ISA. Now firstly, we need to define our web listener. So click on the uh, network object under the toolbox, network objects, and uh, you're able to see a web listener. Right click and select new web listener. Let's give it a name. So we call it as uh, external web 80. Click on the next. Select the external because this is where the uh, request come from. Select next. We use the uh, port number 80 and click on the next and finish. Select the uh, apply. Click on that. Now once the um, object already been created, we are going to check to see if the firewall able to listen to port number 80. Select the OK because it's finished. Now let's go to a start run command and type that net stat minus NA. As you can see from here, the listening port None of this is port number 80 except the uh, uh, 8080 listen in our internal IP. But none of this is port number 80. So just by creating a web listener doesn't really create or doesn't really open the port number 80 in our firewall. So the next thing we need to do here is to create a rules. So go to the task. We need to select publish a web server give it a name web home page which is in Sydney click on the next we select the allowed now the IP address on our uh, Sydney we can use IP address or we can use the uh, computer name sydney.condoso dot com okay so we use the default next so the public name that we want to assess will be triple w dot contoso dot com Okay, so make sure that the spelling is correct. Click on the next. The web listener, we select the uh, external web port number 80. So this is the description. Click on the next. We apply for all the user and click on the finish. Let's look at it, unknown name. So let's check it again. It seems to be okay, and um, this one is supposed to be in the um, last before last rules. All right, so we are going to move down and select the apply. Okay, so once it's finished, uh, let's check out the uh, listener to see whether it's really listening or not. Again, net stat minus NA. Yes, it is. And you can see that it's listened to port number 80, 39.1.1.1. Okay, so we are going to test our um, setting now. So now we need to go to the uh, Istanbul. All right, because Istanbul is going to connect to uh, Sydney. Let's move on to Istanbul now. Right now, I'm in uh, Istanbul. All right, so let's open our Internet Explorer. And um, we are going to go to HTTP. www.contoso. 
dot com you should able to access to Sydney alright so you can see that this is a Sydney web page and um, if let's say I go into my command prompt and I try to ping to www.contoso.com and you can see that it will able to resolve to 39111 and you can see it's timeout. The reason is because that the ISA server do not allow the ping from the uh, external uh, to the internal. Alright, so now uh, as you can see that the um, 39.1.1.1 is the listener for the forums, which is our ISR server, which forward the request port number 80 to Sydney. Now, as you can see that the condoso.com also resolved to 39.1.1.1. What if I type 39.1.1.1? Enter, and uh, you can see from here, it cannot connect. Alright, it's forbidden. Now, what is the reason? So, let's go back into our ISR server. Okay, now on rules number 4 here, which is web homepage Sydney, right click, go to the property. And um, if you can go to the public name, because you can see that the ISA server only recognize condoso.com. So let's click on the add. In, in this case, we need to type in the uh, IP address 39.1.1.1. Click OK. And you click on OK. Alright, so we need to apply and remember that the ISA server only uh, listens to whatever that you specified in the rules. And uh, while we are still in here, remember that this is from the external going to our internal. Alright, this is our internal network which is in the parameter DMZ. So if you can go back to your network and uh, close our task here, what is the um, relation from the uh, external to the internal? All right, will it be uh, routed or will it be the net? Okay, you can see that from the parameters to the external is the route, parameter access. Okay. Now let's go back into our um, uh, Istanbul. Again, you can see that this is uh, Istanbul. And let refresh. Now because now I do allow the IP address and the domain name, I can see the home page. 